Well, we're, we're here on Clapham Common and we've been working through the night to erect the biggest easel and portrait ever seen in Europe to mark the Sky Portrait Artist of the Year competition. It's um, 85 times bigger than the original Mona Lisa. It stands over 14 metres tall. That was asked by Sky Arts to uh, recreate the Mona Lisa. This is one of the largest pieces of artwork I've ever had the honour of working with. And um, it took me over a week designing on the computer. And I started off with little pixels and now it's massive. I thought it was a really interesting idea to have such a famous painting being made out of people's self-portraits. It's quite exciting to have my face on the replica because uh, it's just such an iconic piece of artwork. It, firstly, it's one of a kind in that period. The woman is looking out at the person, at the viewer, which is quite unusual. And also, she's not really smiling, she's not really kind of looking serious. It's very serene. I think it has always been about what she's thinking and what is that expression on her face, a bit of mystery. Okay, I'm really pleased to see such a large piece of artwork on display in London. The people's reaction to it has been just great. It's just so unique um, and whether you like her or you don't like her, she's definitely very popular. So I think it's fascinating. Yeah, it's really nice to see the common used for um, not only just sports but for art, art as well. I think it's great. I mean, it's very curious. I'm walking the dog on the common and you see a big screen up painting. Oh, that's the Mona Lisa, but it's not quite. It's made up of lots of different sort of composite images. So it's curious. I mean, uh, really creative and, and lovely on a sunny day to be in the middle of um, Clapham Common.